Okay, so all you'll need to switch from the indoor to outdoor, or vice versa, is the front wheels, the rear tail with wheels, the lift, and the tire wrench right here. And we're going to show you how to change the tire, change it from the indoor kit to the outdoor kit. Okay, so we're going to demonstrate here changing from the indoor kit to the outdoor kit. Um, and to do, to change from outdoor to indoor, it's basically the same, the same process. I'm doing it from a wheelchair just to show that it can be done from a wheelchair, um, you know, without assistance. So the first thing I'm going to do is, is slide the, the lift underneath it. And then I'm just going to pull down on this bar. It's long so that you have leverage to do it. And that's going to lift the tech RMD up high enough that I can do all the changes. So first thing I'm going to do is the tail piece here. And you're just going to change out the whole tail. And that's done with this pin right here. You lift up and if you twist it will lock up. And then I'm just going to slide that off. Put that out of the way. Then I'm going to grab the outdoor tailpiece and it's going to slide in much the same way that I just pulled that one out. Lift up on that pin. I'll show this a little bit. I'm going to lift up on this pin and slide it in and it'll lock into place. So now I'm halfway done. I'm going to grab the each of the wheels. And I'm going to grab the tire wrench. Now on the tire wrench, oh, the other thing I'm going to grab is the remote. And I'll show that in just a second. So on the, the tire wrench, it's going to show you which way to turn the wheels to unlock it. So I'm going to slide that in. There's just the one nut to go over. Now, once I have that on, I'm going to use this remote to drive the tech RMD forward to loosen that bolt. Once that's loosened, this is a magnet. I can just stick it in there and it will stay in place until I put on the outdoor wheel. Okay, I'm just going to pull that wheel off. And set it to the side. Now there's a there's a pin in there that'll lock along here, and this red dot right here will show you where to line that up. So as you can see right there, if you can see that, that's where it's going to line up with this pin. I'm just going to slide that wheel on. Once it's on, I've already got the, the bolt in there. And I'm just going to go the opposite way of, the, of loosening it to tighten it up. And again, I'll just use the remote. Okay, so then all I'm going to do is, is turn it in the opposite direction of the arrow because I want to tighten it. And I'll do that until I feel it get, until I feel that it's tight and it's on there all the way. Okay.
And then I'm just going to pull this off and do the other side. Now once I've got that on, again I'm just going to turn it in the direction to loosen it. So that would be driving it in reverse. I'm just going to pull that bolt out. Now there may be some washers that come with it in the indoor kit. We'll just set that with the indoor tire to the side. And then I'm going to put the outdoor tire on. And again, I'm going to line this dot up with that notch in, in, the, in there. And that'll slide right on. The, the nut is magnetized in there. So I'll put this on. And then I'm just going to go the opposite way to tighten it back up. And you can use the remote because that does it at a controlled speed so that once it gets on there all the way tight, it's not going so fast it's pulling the wrench out of your hand. You'll feel it once it gets on there tight. Like that. I'm going to pull that out. And then the only thing I have left to do is take it back off the ramp. Let me show that. Yeah. And that's just lifting up on this and lowering it back down. Now I've got the ramp out of the way. I'm good to go ahead and get in the, the Tech RMD.